Sometimes I feel really bad for Anga because by Indonesian standards, he's a great husband. He cooks, he even does chores around the house. But no matter how modern he appears to be, sometimes he just comes up with this stuff that makes me feel like I'm living in the 1950s, you know? What is this? I'm going out with Chelsea, I told you. She invited me to a party. It's 8.30. Kalau jam segini baru pergi, nanti mau pulang jam berapa, Sas? Malu sama tetangga nanti. Are you even being serious right now? Nanti aku dibilang suami macam apa, biarin istri keluar malam-malam, Sas. How dare I try to leave the house at 8.30 in the evening? A fragile female creature such as myself could easily be raped, robbed, murdered, or, or worse, talk to other men. Saya gitu kan karena sayang. Kalau enggak sih saya biarin aja. Suami manapun yang sayang sama istri pasti akan kasih tahu mana yang baik, mana yang tidak baik. See, that's what I mean. In Indonesia, men are taught that they should control their wives as if she's an 8-year-old. And meanwhile, us wives, this is the type of advice we get. Cara jadi istri baik. Ah, baca lagi nih, bikin malas. Suami Anda butuh sosialisasi. Anda cukup tahu sama siapa dan di mana suami Anda berada tanpa terlalu banyak masuk campur urusannya. Thanks crappy Indonesian website. I'll do that now. Where are you going? Mau ke Kuta, Sa. Kan udah aku bilang. Sama siapa? Sama Patuku. Isn't he that guy that goes to the Panti Pijat Plus Plus and then goes to Jumatan the next day? Ya. Yeah. Oh great! I love him. He's such a nice guy. Tell him I said hi. Yeah, nanti saya salamin ya. Bye. I don't care if he goes out with Tuki freaking what's his face, but I deserve to socialize too. Boleh kok, silakan aja kalau mau sosialisasi ke pasar ke, ikut arisan ke. Saya nggak akan pernah larang kok. Do I look like I want to go to an Arisan? Seriously. Seharusnya saya ini kurangin baca artikel dan fokus kepada kewajibannya. Urus saya dan urus Z. Masalahnya saya itu terlalu egois. Sa. Hold on a second. What? Kamu masih temenan sama mantan kamu di Facebook? What? Yang pura-pura lupa kamu masa sama mantan lupa? Nih. Si temenan sama Aldi nih. Jadi mau unfriend kan nih? Why should I have to unfriend somebody just because I dated them 10 years ago? Aku cuma mau tahu, kamu mau unfriend gak? No, I'm not gonna unfriend him. He's insecure. Dia egois. Insecure. Egois. I'm sorry, I don't negotiate with terrorists. Loh, terorisnya siapa? Menurut saya, kalau dia mau hidup gaya barat, nikahlah sama orang barat. Jangan sama saya. Terus keluar deh dari Indonesia. He says I'm stubborn, but he is way more stubborn than me. And when he starts going on about my country, my way, that's when I know that I have to do something really Indonesian to make him happy again. Sa, bakar apaan sih? Bau banget ke dalam masapnya. Me, I'm just burning my bikini because I want to be the kind of wife you deserve. And you deserve a wife who swims in her clothing. Akhirnya, Sa. You know what? I think that if Anga was the bule and I was the Indonesian, that we would probably have a better relationship because I would have been raised from birth to obey and serve my husband. And he would have been raised to respect gender equality. So I would have exceeded his expectations and we'd live happily ever after. Saya kira kalau saya seorang Garut. His mother's from Garut, that's why. Ya memang. Dan orang tua saya sudah 40 tahun nikah loh. 
apa salahnya sih ikutin gaya Indonesia? Sudah terbukti kok hasilnya. Fine. I'll unfriend Aldi on Facebook, okay? As long as he unfriends Suzy first. Didn't think I noticed that, did ya? Well, I notice everything. Are you gonna unfriend her? Like seriously, that article that I mentioned, like about cara jadi istri yang baik, that was real. Some of them are okay, like Tulus, Mencintai Swami, like what partner doesn't want to be loved, right? But some of them are like, patu terhadap perintah suami. Tidak ada suami di dunia yang ingin memiliki seorang istri tipe pemberontak. Kepatuhan terhadap perintah suami merupakan kewajiban seorang istri. Dengarkan setiap perkataannya dengan antusias. Oh, here's a good one. Jaga penampilan. Jangan sampai suami anda tidak mengajak anda saat ada pesta di kantor karena penampilan anda yang kurang menarik ya. Meskipun anda wanita karir dengan kesibukan luar biasa, jangan menduakan suami anda demi pekerjaan. Anda memang punya hak untuk bekerja dan membantu suami mencari nafkah. Namun, patut ingat bahwa kewajiban Anda adalah mengurus suami dan anak-anaknya. So, if you're a doctor, keep your priorities straight. Life saving, that is on the back burner. Get your man some tea, ladies. When I read this list of like 10 ways to be a good wife, it gave me diarrhea, guys. I gotta go. Mm.